I've started picking more lemons. All, all, kinds, all kinds of them are ripe now. But how do I cut them? Well, you can easily just slice them, lay them down, slice them. But what if you want wedges? Perfectly shaped wedges. I have a new little tool. I'm going to show it to you. I love it. I did like four lemons, maybe 30 seconds. So I'm going to show you how to cut some lemons. Aren't these massive? They smell so good. So welcome back to Suburban Homesteader, Wyoming, Arizona. This is Sandy. And we are going to go over. I'm going to show you how I cut wedges in lemons and the little tool that I use. We have to go over to the lemon tree first. This tree is so loaded with lemons. I have part of it propped up because it is just jam packed with lemons. This is my mom and dad's lemon tree. And I usually use my nippers, but I'm filming with one hand. So I'm just going to twist that off and pick a few lemons, four, five, six, whatever I feel like. Now they tell you just to put it in the green stand and push it through. And it does work that way until you go to pull it out. So what I have started to do is I'm cutting the very bottom of it. You slide it in the green stand and it's like a wedger for an apple. So if you want to cut your apples in wedges, it's basically the same idea. And see how that just pops apart? And you can just do hundreds of lemons in such a short amount of time. One more time. I have so much fun doing this. Line it up and there it goes. I could do this all day long. That's right. Now this lemon was just too large. It was larger than what the circular part of, that makes the wedges. Joe loves lemon water. So I'm making him some lemon water to just have in the refrigerator. It's pretty strong and sometimes it gets so strong you have to add a little bit more water to it. I bought it at a store, but I'm sure you can buy them someplace online. Have a great day, everybody. I'll see you next time.